Black Adam, we finally get to see these other characters. Hawkman, uh, Dr. Fate, um, the one that this guy is playing. Adam, um, Adam Smasher. Adam Smasher, yes. Adam Smasher. That looked pretty dope. It looked pretty dope. So we finally get to see uh, the Justice Society. Brian, what were your uh, what was your reaction when you saw this? Um, uh, when you saw when you finally saw these other characters, uh, were you impressed? What, what were your thoughts when you saw this? Yeah, I agree. So this was in the context of the DC Heroes 2022 montage. It was very short. It was a 60 second spot, which basically some encompassed the Batman. Got nothing new there. Yeah. Um, Flash, nothing new there. All footage, I think. I think it was all footage we had seen from the Fandom trailer. Maybe a, there was one shot of the suit charging up that we hadn't seen. Yeah. Aquaman, we got a shot of the new suit yeah. and a shot of the old one, yeah. but no new line. That was a line from the first movie. And then we got this these quick cut Black Adam shots. Look, I agree. I, you know, in some ways, I, I thought. So, my, yeah, I think my favorite, I like Dr. Fate and I like the Adam Smasher. I thought the Adam Smasher scale, it didn't look cheap. Like when yeah. he was running, when he's kind of running through this like wasteland town or whatever, mm-hmm. like in some ways it looked better than like, you, remember, you know, when, when, when like Ant-Man becomes giant, there's mm-hmm. a few moments where like the physics look a little bit off. Mm-hmm, like mm-hmm, he's, mm-hmm. and this one looked a little cleaner in fairness, yes. like same idea, looked mm-hmm. a little cleaner, the damage that he was doing. So I like that. Like, I mean, Pierce Brosnan has one of the best voices, I think, of, of any actor in, in, in working today. And so to hear him kind of kind of maxing out his Pierce Brosnan yeah. in sort of talking, clearly talking and pleading with, with Black Adam. And he looked good. Like, he looked good as, like, an older Dr. Fate in the helmet. Yeah. Um, they tweaked the... They, I think they, they kind of took the color palette down a little bit. Dr. Fate usually portrays, like, very bright, like, yes. yellow or whatever. And they kind of toned that down. It looked pretty good, and yeah, look. I mean, the rock, the rock suit looks fine. I mean, I, I mean, I, I'm not surprised. I mean, like mm-hmm. we knew it was going to be sort of comic staple, and he he obviously fills it out like no other actor could. Um, I, I did want to see one real shot of him doing some of this new effects that they've teased, and I guess we didn't really get that. But but no, I agree with you. I mean, like I just don't understand how the these shots weren't ready for fandom two years ago to be quite honest like that yeah. these are the scenes that we should have seen at fandom during the pandemic yeah my opinion. yeah it's man a plus one. it's a plus one for the film yeah. no question yeah 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 um still not super excited more curious than excited um i want to see this film and what this is going to be um but yeah i i'm just even keel not super excited for this um uh, let's see what this does at the box office will it make do you think it's going to make a billion i'm in the camp of zero percent chance so i can't come off wow that. Okay. <laughs> i can't come off that <laughs> okay yeah I, I i think i'm there with you uh, my opinion will change once uh the review embargo uh, comes out if the review embargo comes out like two days before the movie comes out then i'm we can sort of <laughs> uh guarantee well, that this yeah. Movie, yeah 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 um then we know. but yeah let us I know think even the if the reviews are good i think even if the reviews are good i don't think it gets there i think people just forget like, like i said when it's a first go it is so hard to get to one billion dollars like people toss that number around because Marvel made it look easy, but it's yeah. not like, it's just not like this movie. The rock has said he wants it to be a billion. I'm just saying the history is clearly on my side in the sense of, but this movie could make 650 and it would be a phenomenal success as a debut movie for a new character. That would be a accurate statement. The bar is Aquaman. First time out a billion. And it, and it, and it wasn't to me. You know how I feel. I don't think it was a fantastic movie. I don't think it. I don't think that's a billion dollar film. But it made a billion dollars. I think The Rock is looking at that as the bar and how he can he can throw his 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 name in there as as another billion dollar man. 
because of all the success uh, of that Marvel has had, the success that Aquaman has had, and uh, all he needs this movie to be is a great movie or at least a really decent showing um, for it to get there. Um, so it has but a Aquaman, chance. So I, but see, like, so w- the two things I would say about Aquaman, though, is number one, you know, I, I know we, we, we pan Justice League, but don't underestimate that, like, Aquaman was on screen yeah, before true. he did his own movie, right? Is it safe? Mm-hmm, like, mm-hmm. You know, it's, it's, it's like Black Panther and Civil War. That's a much better movie. But it's like, it does help when the actor and the suit make a substantial appearance before they get their own film. So I, I, to true. me, Aquaman's got an asterisk. The other asterisk, like I said, is what made Aquaman a billion dollar movie is it struck this chord in Asia. And James Wan is a director with a huge sort of, he has a following because of his work okay. in the horror genre. And that really paid overseas. So th- yeah. those are two things that Black Adam doesn't have working for it. I realize The Rock is a bigger star than Jason Momoa was at the time. Mm-hmm. But it, it doesn't have that, you know, built in sort of things. Work. Like, I think if Black Adam had popped up, honestly, like, had he been in Shazam in like a secondary role, I'd be a little more inclined to say, yes then a billion dollars might be in play. Yes. But because it, we're just coming out of the shoot with this, I, I, I stay in my way side. I think it's going to be tough. I think I'm thinking more like 650, um, 700 maybe. But like that's kind of what I'm thinking this, this settles out. And like I said, it will make money at that level. Yeah. A lot of debut superheroes don't get to that level. So Yeah. Yeah, let us know in the conversation below. Uh, what did you think of the the images that you got from that, that we were given from uh, Warner brothers on the black Adam visually, I think that it looked dope. Let us know in the comment section below what you guys thought of it. And do you think it makes a billion dollars? Uh, it'll be interesting to see if that happens, man, that'll be an interesting conversation when that does, if that does happen. Uh, Mo- 